here we are in the beginning of what may be uh, a string of videos coming from Celinda and myself. What I'm doing right now is I'm going outside. As you can see, there is the back door into my house. And I'm coming outside. Here to the girls. Yep, go on inside, girls. Good girls. And I'm coming out to take some snow from the outside here. There we go. There we go. Let's take this chunk of snow right here. This looks good. Come on, honey. And the reason that we are making this video is because Celinda and myself just saw a shared video on Facebook of a gentleman doing this exact same thing that we're about to do. And this is to basically prove to family and friends, because we love you so much, the validity of our concerns in geoengineering. Now here's a lighter and a piece of snow. See the black smoke coming off of it? Yep, there's black smoke coming smells off like of that. Smells like plastic. Smells like plastic. And do you oh, see that? Ladies that and gentlemen, disgusting. do you... Hold on. Do you see that? Mmm. Mm. Smell that plastic smell. Now, we've all played in the snow as see children. Any drips? All of us. We've all played in the snow as children. Okay. Has that that's, ever... I think that's enough. Has that's, that ever happened to I don't any want of you? chemicals in here. As children, now did you see any water dripping from that? Hands. Did you see any water dripping from that piece of snow? There it is, melting away like a piece of styrofoam. Now look underneath. But whatever it's made of. You can out see of... the reflection of my lighter in the glass. But whatever it's made of, do you see it's... water coming off of that snow? Like any snow you've it's burned in your entire gas. life. It's turning into a gas. No. It's no water underneath it. It is evaporating into a gas. Do you know why? Because it is filled with non-organic toxic chemicals. Mm -mm -mm. And the term chemtrails is just silly. That is our savior, savior from global warming geoengineering now let me as you can see here here's the piece if you ever grabbed a piece of snow as a kid in your house and you set it inside and right now the thermostat is set rather comfortably in the mid to the high 60s look where's the water where, where where is the water now I don't do this for my own amusement because like Celinda mentioned the smell is disgusting coming off of this but I urge you Go outside, grab a piece of snow, get a map gas torch, and burn it real quick like the guy did in the video that we watched today. And watch, now I'm going to go into my freezer. I'm going to grab an ice cube. Doo -doo -doo. Here's an ice cube. I'll hold that. I'm not afraid of this. Now, let's... Light this ice cube up. Oh, oh, what is that? What, what is that coming off the ice right there? Oh, Shiva, a drip of water. Shiva, hey, Shiva, what is, what is that, honey? What, what, what is that coming off of there? Oh, look at that! It's not charring. It's hydrogen dioxide. Get, get out of here. There it is, dripping right off the piece, like normally a piece of snow would do in your hands dripping when you hold down it, onto right? My fingers. Dripping down onto your fingers. Which the snow is not. Making a puddle of water underneath of it. I urge you all, please, go outside and <laughs> play in the snow. And question, what are they doing in the sky every day? that this is what our snow looks like now.